Well, I'm not sure where you'd put it, but since we're in the board reloading stage, obviously it's going to be in the uh, somewhere between referral team and event, uh, getting face-to-face -face meetings with potential board members. Because um, I mean, if you're if you're thinking, you know, granted you can run uh, both tracks simultaneously, but if you're thinking about it sequentially or ultimately logically, which one needs to come first? We got to get the board reestablished first mm -hmm. before you can establish the flow. But you can start both at the same time. But I think that's a higher priority. Yeah, healthy referral team equals healthy event. So. The well, it, yeah, but I was talking about the stuff over here, what we're trying to aim for. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah, absolutely, healthy referral team equals a healthy event. That's <laughs> bottom line. That was what was wrong with the other one. Um, so, yeah, uh, getting face to face meetings to reload the board. Okay. Okay. Good. So we'll talk about the monthly schedule, mm -hmm. the team meeting schedule, recruiting. Um, from the aspect of getting the strategic introductions to reload your board. Right. What else? What are some other areas where like, uh, we're not as tight on that as we could have? I think it's too soon to tell, to be honest with you. Okay. I mean, I think those are just, that's, that's really all there is that we need to focus on. Have you run your first event on your own yet? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Yeah. Um, and then, do you all have a system that you're using to generate referrals for each other within your referral? Oh, heck no. We're barely getting to know each other. I mean, that's, yeah. you know, that's what I'm saying. We've got uh, the only real certified other board member I have is Matt Baudlin. He came with me from uh, uh, Teresa's AB, mm -hmm. and he and I have done a lot of the talking together about how to reconstitute the board, what we're going to set for standards, how we're going to go about uh, essentially uh, candidating potential prospects, that sort of thing. Uh, but everybody else, uh, I've got I've got four other guys, three other guys, um, are still um, in the dating process. We haven't actually gotten to the all three yet. Um, that makes sense. But we're working. Yeah, we're, it, there's a pretty good possibility that all three of them are going to join. Um, they just haven't got there yet. So. Okay. I'm just laughing because I have a comment that probably should not be on this tape here. Yeah, probably you probably shouldn't. So. About the dating process. Yeah, well, I mean know. that's what this is. It's like speed dating. You know, you go into yeah. a room and you. You know, two minutes with each potential prospect, and you work your way around the room, and then you say, "Hey, we're gonna get together again." And you know, you want to have that level of commitment rather than just people that hang out occasionally or socialize. Yeah. And so. Yeah. Okay. So I think we have some good starting points to really have a strong conversation. Um, we'll talk about board recruiting, and then I'll, we'll also go through our referral generation system. Okay. So one of the things that helped me, it took me um, two months to build up my referral team. Um, to where it was strong in trading referrals, mm -hmm. and then I have a two month, I have about a 45 day sales cycle myself personally. Okay. So it took me five months to close my first deal from the referral system. system. Right. Okay. Um, which is about average, you know, you know, from two to five, to two to six months is how it works. But um, for you individually or across the Rainmakers? You across the Rainmakers. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, but I think the difference is, and the reason why it happened pretty quickly for us quickly in quotes, right? It was average, but it sure. um, faster than the average of most people right? Uh, in reality. The reason it worked that way is because we had a referral generation system in place right away. Okay. And we kind of took dating to like um, home run on the first date, if you get what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. And we did it that way so we could just jump in and build relationships at the same time and trust. Mm -hmm. And that took me saying, hey, we're going to jump in, we're going to trade some referrals and open up your contacts. Somebody mm -hmm. screws up, you screw up, and you're out. Right. Um, so we'll talk about how to get that going so you can get some money faster. Okay. Um, anything else you want to make sure we talk about? No, I think, I mean, I, I, I just think that's such a central issue that Barring that, everything else is just the peripherals. Sweet. 50%. I like that number. 